if you are watching this video i believe you are someone who is at a crossroad and you're figuring out which way to go should i choose affiliate marketing or should i choose freelancing and in this episode i am going to help you choose between the two what are the big differences what are the pros and cons between affiliate marketing and freelancing and everything you need to know is coming up hey i am sunil hegde i am a digital entrepreneur and founder of dream lifestyle hub if someone asked me to present a elevator debate to compare affiliate marketing and freelancing my answer is pretty simple you should not even compare these two why because one is a job and another one is a business freelancing is a typical job and affiliate marketing is a business why are you even comparing sounds crazy let me quickly explain you what is freelancing freelancing is nothing but you are selling your expertise you are selling your skills and you get to work from a brand maybe businesses entrepreneurs solopreneurs and you complete a project you trade your time in exchange of money that is freelancing let me quickly show you on my screen this is a famous website called fiverr and another one is upwork there are so many freelancing websites are there in fiverr you can see what are the skills or your expertise you can sell okay you can see here you have graphic design digital marketing various subs there writing and translation contents video and animation music and audio programming and tech you have business related lifestyle related and all this trending like nft data drop shipping game development all those stuffs okay so this is all about freelancing what is affiliate marketing affiliate marketing is nothing but you are promoting someone else product or the service and you make a commission when you make a sale so that is a simple definition of affiliate marketing now let's quickly go to the mind map i want to walk you through what will be covered in this episode first i am going to talk about three golden rules these are not only for affiliate marketing or freelancing any profession you take and apply these three golden rules you will not have any confusion whatsoever yeah then i am going to talk about affiliate marketing versus freelancing the big differences pros and cons so that you can choose what is best for you all right now let's look at three golden rules and the first one is passion what are you really passionate about what do you really love doing is it job or is it business is it just because someone has a lot of money as an entrepreneur you want to do you see in their lifestyle that's how you want to do or you sympathize with people's problem you love solving people's problem what is that reason not everyone is suitable for business there are so many people in this world who love doing job so first thing you have to ask what are you passionate about what do you really love doing it yeah then the second rule is time and the third one is money these are interrelated i keep asking this to my inner circle what is your choice of freedom what do you really want to do with the freedom what is your definition if you have lots of time but you don't have money that is not real freedom you have lots of money but you don't have time to enjoy that is also not real freedom so you got to understand how much time you want to invest and in turn how much money the potential money you want to earn so these are the three golden rules so the first one is passion if you don't love what you are doing there is no question of even going to the rule number 2 and 3 so to start with passion what are you really passionate about find out then think about time and the money how much time you want to invest and how much money you want to earn yeah now let's move on to the next section affiliate marketing versus freelancing here i will help you choose between the two with just four simple but powerful parameters and the first one is type as i told you earlier freelancing is a job and affiliate marketing is business the mindset required to do a job versus business is totally different it is a employee versus employer mindset do you really love taking risk do you embrace uncertainty then business is for you you don't want to take risk you want to play safe 
then job is for you so you got to understand the difference between job and business what mindset you really want to inculcate based on that you got to choose do you really want to do affiliate marketing or freelancing yeah now let's move on to the second parameter which is time time and tide waits for none you would have heard this yeah so for your exponential growth time can be a deterrent or time can aid you so let's look at about the time the freelancing you are limited by time you can work for 8 hours 10 hours 12 hours 16 hours max you are the brain you are the legs you are the hand to complete a project so you are limited by your time your growth is limited by time yeah however in affiliate marketing it works round the clock 24 by 7 even you can earn while you sleep sounds crazy at the last i am going to tell you how you can even earn while you sleep with the right systems with the right automation the systems on behalf of you you will work 24 by 7 365 days how awesome is that so affiliate marketing is not limited by time but freelancing is limited by time yeah now let's look at third parameter which is earning potential what is the earning potential if you compare affiliate marketing with freelancing yeah so as a freelancer you can earn anywhere between zero dollar to two thousand dollar per month only if you are super famous freelancer the best you can think of earning four thousand to five thousand dollar per month but there is a limit how much you can earn why as we have already seen you are limited by time only so many hours you can work in a day only so many hours you can work in a week so there is a ceiling and it is very difficult super difficult i would say to break that barrier yeah however in affiliate marketing you can earn anywhere between zero dollar to millions multi-million dollars per month so there is no ceiling the exponential growth you can have an unlimited amount of money you can earn as an affiliate entrepreneur yeah now let's look at fourth parameter which is investment here we are talking about business versus job and business cannot run without an investment yeah so as a freelancer you might need to invest anywhere between zero dollar to x x x dollar why because i don't know you might need different softwares equipments based on your project however why i am calling zero dollar you might be already owning those softwares owning those equipments yeah so for freelancing it is zero dollar to anything let's go to fever and find out what kind of investment you might need to make as a freelancer yeah let's say you are into graphics and design then you might need adobe photoshop canva so many different softwares to design those graphics yeah let's say you are into video and animation then you might need those editing softwares yeah you're into music and audio voice over singers vocalists then you need to invest in a good audio equipment yeah so it depends upon the expertise you're selling the project you are going to do your investment will differ however you might be already owning those equipment owning those software then you no need to invest anything yeah now let's go back to the mind map let's look at how much you got to invest for affiliate marketing yeah you got to invest anywhere between 100 dollar to 200 dollar per month for the basic tools to run your business and also you got to invest in programs courses coaching so that you can develop the skill set required to run that business yeah it can cost anywhere between 100 dollar to 2000 dollar if you want to know more about what are the tools you require to run an affiliate marketing business in the description i have given those details you can go and check it out yeah why i love affiliate marketing as a business model because of the low investment and the high earning potential compare this with any business model tell me any business model you can start as low as 100 dollar to 200 dollar you take drop shipping amazon fba minimum five thousand dollar to ten thousand dollar you go to invest if you take offline business like construction manufacturing maybe a restaurant you have lots of overhead cost you need to pay to the employees infrastructure rent lease so many different costs are there for affiliate marketing as low as 100 dollar to 200 dollar per month you can run the business and you can have an exponential growth yeah
even after going through these four parameters if you are still not sure let me help you my personal recommendation is affiliate marketing because of the low investment with the right kind of systems and automation it can work for you 24 by 7 and literally you can earn money even while you sleep and the earning potential is so huge however you might be having this question sunil when to choose freelancing my simple answer is if you don't have any money to invest and you are in urgent need of money freelancing is the way to go maybe you can start with freelancing try to replace your original income with freelancing income then you can venture into affiliate market if you want to know more about how you can start your affiliate marketing business and build a six or seven figure income within 90 days in the description i have given a link for a master class it is a live and free master class you can go and check it out if you want to continue learning with me on your screen tap or click on the playlist if you got value out of this video please like this video and subscribe to this channel with another super useful episode i'll see you soon until then bye bye